Okay, for those interested in Buddhism, there are a few words used here that need uh, a little bit of an explanation. First, the name Ashoka is the name of the third Mauryan Emperor, Ashoka the Great, whose symbol is, is today the symbol of India. Ashoka the Great was born in 304 BC and died in 232 BC, eventually ruling almost the entire Indian subcontinent. In waging war against the state of Kalinga, known today as Odisha, in the east of India, out of desire for conquest and empire expansion, which left 100,000 dead and with the deportation of 150,000 people led leading to another 50,000 deaths. Ashoka gradually converted to Buddhism from around 263 BC. In reaction to this war, Ashoka dedicated himself to the promotion of Buddhism across Asia, establishing monuments marking significant sites in the life of Siddhartha Gautama. Siddhartha Gautama is the name of Buddha. Stupa is another word that might need some explanation. The stupa is a pre-Buddhist monument in which ascetics were buried in a seated position. After the release of Buddha from his own body, the remains were cremated. These ashes were divided and buried under eight mounds, with two other mounds holding the urn and the fire ashes. Identifying all ten stupas is impossible, but it's very likely that the later stupa built at Sarnath and Sanchi are newer versions of the older stupas, probably the original, going back to Buddha's time. And this stupa, that is the solid stupa, complete stupa, nothing inside, no hall, no gate, no window, no door. This is the memory of the Buddha, where Lord Buddha gave the first sermon, first teaching of the five people. So this is stupa. After Buddha came the Ashoka and he was built 300 BC. And this is stupa, very big size. Everywhere is stupa, but not same. Different, different stupa. And the every stupa inside, different part of the Buddha. And this is stupa inside, just ashes of the Buddha, ashes. So this monument, this time of the Ashoka and the original Buddha temple, was here. So that temple destroyed by Muslim people. Then after all things cover inside. Cover inside. So archaeological government, they are excavated from here. And some for the Buddhist monk, the house and the residential place and the original temple and the stupa inside. So it is the ruins of Sarnath monuments area. So, so, now, uh, so now you will go and just to walking and come. So this is the original, original original temple that was built after Buddha gave his lecture by the King Ashoka. Ashoka. Sirasa Namah